Hello everybody and welcome back to Crusader Kings where we are working on putting our realm back together. Now we do have dangerous factions here. The question is how real are these? Because I just started up the game. They may or may not be super real. Let's see. The populace are a little bit real. Okay. We already demanded conversion from both of these, I believe, and they declined. Actually, they're going to also be fake, I think. They're slightly below threshold. Let's give this a moment. But this ransom is acceptable. This ransom is acceptable. Yep, these look good. Not this guy, though. Get out of here. Okay, so that is all fine. We're at 4,000 gold right now, and we would like to get ourselves some prestige. Now, ideally, we would be of age right now. We're not of age. We could do a grand tournament, and we will get some prestige from it. We can't participate in this grand tournament, though. So, there is that. Well, maybe we could participate in the archery? I'm not sure. A lot of these we can't participate in, though. Board game? Sure. Horse race? We might be able to do that. Wrestling and duel? Probably we can't do either of those. But let's see here. Let's go ahead and run this. And our intent would be, I guess, recreation. Really, our intent, though... <laughs> <laughs> is not that. Our intent really is... Yeah, we can have this guy be our champion. Um, sure. We want to get as much prestige as we can, right? So, prizes are going to go up to maximum. 4,440 gold. Okay, we've got this ransom. That'll be 10 additional gold. 30 additional gold. So, we need like 300 gold here. A curse undone. Okay, our rival died. Sure, that seems fine. Plus 88 gold. Okay, that's not too bad. These ransoms are going to be reasonably good. This is 100 gold here. Yep, we're at 4302. We're very close now. 4391 from that month tick. Next month tick, we'll be able to do this. It's very expensive. Don't get me wrong. But we need a lot of prestige here. Yeah, we'll take this gold. There's the month tick. We can't start it because we're a child. Oh, I didn't realize that we can't start it when we're a child. I knew we couldn't participate in these when we're a child. But we can't start it because we're a child. In which case, can we run a feast? At least? We don't have a promoted legend. Yeah. So, it would be here in Kong. Well, actually, would it? Hang on. Would it be in Kong? It looks like it would be better to be elsewhere. In, like, Korhogo. Or Banifing. Yeah. Banifing would be best. There is a little bit of danger on this route. There's Drylands. So we could simply hire something like a Desert Warrior. And now there's no danger on the route. This would cost us 347 gold, but we can't do this because we're a child. Okay, so we just can't do that. Noted. Well, we'll have to build up our prestige the old-fashioned way, by making titles. So that is fine. We're going to transfer this guy over. What titles can we create here? So we can create the Kingdom of Yemen and Galicia. We should definitely do that. So we're going to create the Kingdom of Galicia. We'll create the Kingdom of Yemen. That gives us 2,183 prestige. We can use that to go after this guy, or actually this lady. 945? This is a lot cheaper than it was. Interesting. This was 1,800 previously. This guy would become our vassal? He reports to Takura right now. Do it. This is absolutely something I want to do. Do we want to grab these as long as we're here? They would cost piety, if I recall correctly. This one would be prestige. Okay. Let's grab the prestige one. We'll leave the piety one alone for right now. She'll likely become our vassal once we... Once we become her rightful liege. Okay. So that seems reasonably fine. I want to raise up our forces here. This is maybe slightly greedy. We'll see what that ends up looking like. 
So how many forces are we gonna need for this? Not many is the answer. We'll just go to like 10K. This is, this is sufficient. This is more than enough. Okay, so we're gonna move our forces in to Algier here. We'll just get this knocked out real quick. What is our Regent's mandate right now? Fill coffers. I honestly want our Regent to be on promote authority. That'll be fine. Okay, so in we go to Algier here. And that will fall extraordinarily quickly. They're heading south. Noted. This war is over. We're going to enforce those demands. And we're going to head into their capital. We're probably just going to siege these areas, to be honest. How's our Hogan endorsement going? Oh, he doesn't like us. Okay. That is noted. We're 11 right now. Out of curiosity, we have to be 12 this way, right? Yes, that is correct. So that's fine. We're going to take over their capital here. Is she located in her capital? No, she is located in this army. Noted. Well, we siege this very quickly indeed. We captured her daughter, putting us at 88%. Excellent. Well, let's just take over to Herit here. They're sieging very slowly. So this looks absolutely fine. We're at 94. This should end the war, to be honest. Very quick. I like it. 10 days to go. Do we want to be sadistic or paranoid? Hmm. Possibly sadistic here. Yeah, we'll do it. Okay, so let's enforce these demands. There we go. And disband these troops. Now, the question is, can we get the Empire title of Maghreb? Yes, we can. Fantastic. So consider that created. And of course, this is de jure part of Italia. So that's a bit of a problem. 41 reasons to not do this. She has 19 opinion against us. And her opinion of us... is minus six. Okay, so that's about one third. Noted. We're probably best off to attack her with piety once we get enough. We have the ability now to seize all de jure lands up over here though. And we're truced with this guy. When is that truce going to be up? Four years? Noted. Are we still truced without our Ajuron? Yes, we are. Okay. So we're waiting on all of these African holdings at this point. Now we can focus in on Hispania. How are we doing on the Hispanian title? We need eight counties. Okay. So this would be a county here. But we have this de jure. So we can do that. The Sunni Caliphate out over here. This is not de jure. 108. Done. What about Mallorca? This should be a duchy tier, right? Yeah, that's a duchy tier. So we need to do a conquer duchy. 684. Done. So we're going to attack these four for now. And then we're going to come up over this direction. No doubt about that. Let's raise up just men at arms. I don't think we need any levy troops whatsoever for this. We're greedy raising this. We'll see if he comes in and tries to stack wipe our zero troops that are here. No, nah, he's going to let us raise. How nice of him. Okay. So that's wonderful. In we go. So that's an easy stack wipe for our very powerful troops. And we're going to finish up this siege nice and quickly. We should probably consider spending gold on our buildings. Oh, this plague is not great, but whatever. So we should boost up our trebuchets with workshops. Here in Boron, we would be boosting our armored footmen. So that would be getting smithies going. Here would be, we'd be boosting cavalry. So that would be boosting our stone watchtowers. Here is pikemen. So stockades. Here is archers. So we would get string cages. And that kind of finishes this up. Pikemen, but we would be able to get root cellars. Trebuchets, we could get bellows, but that doesn't actually do anything for trebuchets. This would just be boosting our taxes here. So I guess we'll get that. That is our gold spent. Fantastic. We'll finish up this siege. And that war is over. So we're going to enforce those demands. And we are going to make our way over to here. That's going to cost us 78 gold to board. Okay. 
that's reasonably fine. I'm not too concerned about that. And of course, we're going to attack in the north up here too of Hispania. But for the moment, we want to get ourselves in a much better position. Are we 12 yet? No. When were we born? 31 December. Okay. So this independence faction is a thing that exists. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting indeed. I'd like to arrange marriage with this kid. But apparently, yeah, we've got a sister here. Yeah, this is fine. Do it. Absolutely wonderful. So that'll get him out of that faction, in theory. Unless his kid was landed. His kid was landed. Okay, that's lame. <laughs> well, who, what, do we, what else do we have here? This guy is 60% faction commitment. He's minus 85 right now. He is not happy about his cultural acceptance. We're not his rightful liege. No alliance as clan vassal. What is his zakat trait? Ah, his taxes. Okay. Yeah, he's not very happy. We can demand his conversion. That might make him a little happier. I'm going to send him a gift first. So that'll be 19 opinion. Boosting him up to 56. That's actually quite a lot better. And now I want to try to demand his conversion. We have a 50-50 on that. He declined. Okay. <laughs> That's fine. We may want to just fight these guys, to be honest. Never mind. Somebody left the faction. It's irrelevant. Okay, cool. So that is absolutely fine. We're going to enforce these demands, and we're going to head over to Mallorca. So we need to grant this title out. We don't want to hold that ourselves. We do need a new tax collector, which would be, say, this guy. Phenomenal. And into Mallorca we head. Oh, apparently Discord is giving sounds. That is exciting. Can we not do that, Discord? Thanks. Can I mute Discord here? Hang on. We got this. Discord muted. Fantastic. Excellent. So this crime cannot go unpunished. Definitely. We're going to invade Mallorca. And this is absolutely going to be very quick. Yeah, war's over. Fantastic. So we'll enforce those demands and disband these troops. Now, we need to grant these titles out, and we definitely will do so. That sounds good for the moment. Then, the question is, what do we need now for Hispania? Four additional counties is the answer. Okay. So if we were to go for Leon here, that would be very expensive. It'd be cheaper to do this. 684 for that. Okay, I'm wondering if we can do something up over here, maybe. This would be three for the same amount. So let's declare that. And then we go for like two, which is de jure. And that should do the trick. We're going to raise up our men at arms over here and go into Alcanis. Excellent. And these guys are going to run around a bit over here. They actually have a fair number of troops. They must have brought in a holy order, and there's a bunch of allies joining. But we don't exactly care about that. We could raise up a few extra forces specifically for the ability to station besiegers. That's probably for the best. So we'll raise up about 10k here. This will be fine. And inward we go. Excellent. We're going to want to fight these forces, of course. I'm going to group these, and then I'm going to station besiegers, and I'm going to leave behind another, like, 7k here. So we're going to take these guys out over here while these continue their sieges. Perfect. So they have additional forces on the way in here, but this doesn't matter. Our troops are so, so powerful compared to theirs that it's completely and totally irrelevant. This war is now over. So we're going to enforce those demands. Zaragoza can be granted out. And at this point, we would like to have these guys head over to Tui. That'll take them some time to get there. And these guys are going to head over to Tui as well. Cool. We need another tax collector. Oh, my. This jurisdiction actually filled. Okay. Oh, that's the same guy. Hang on. This guy. Okay. So something along the lines of that. Excellent. 
This 10k stack should be able to defeat this 18k stack just due to troop quality. So I'm not too concerned about that. And even if it can't, these guys are on the way in to reinforce. The evil fiend, indeed. So we're going to attack up over here. No problem whatsoever. These guys are actually running away. Hilarious. And this will give us the Empire of Hispania. So that's absolutely wonderful. We need another tax collector over here. That'll be this guy. Sure. And that was stack wiped. Excellent. No problem. Let's get this siege completed and get Hispania created. This is going to give us de jure claims on all of these areas. And it might... Our regent changed, which is not ideal. Our regent... Not our regent. We might be able to offer vassalage to some of these. So we'll disband that. Let's get Hispania under our control. Hispania cannot be formed till the Iberian struggle has been resolved. It was previously formed. Well, that's rude. Okay, well, I guess that's not going to be a thing. We'll have to go after this the old-fashioned way, which is fine. It's just more expensive in prestige. It's okay. There's a lot of little guys up here. We'll get them captured fairly quickly. So, how's our truces going? Outer Ajuron, still truced. You over here. We can actually go for you now. We can do a Conquer County, and we're absolutely going to do that. Let's get you under control. Get those men-at-arms moved in. No problem. And of course, we're still truced with this guy. That's fine. We're going to start carving through this area pretty quickly. It's going to be a little bit low on the prestige count, but we might be able to create some kingdom titles here. Yes. We can create the Empire of Ajaron, which we should do. That'll be 600 gold, but the Kingdom of Valencia will create for now. Excellent. Uh, what do we want here? 450 gold. And increasing our stewardship. Done. Excellent. So that puts us up to 11 here. That, of course, means that we want to revoke this barony. Done. Fantastic. What else do we want to construct? Well, actually nothing right now. I do want to create the empire title of Ajuron. We want the prestige and the legitimacy, but more importantly, we want the claim on Outer Ajuron here. We are now his de jure rightful liege. So that's really solid. No problem there. The Iberian struggle apparently exists, which is very rude. But we'll get that taken care of eventually. Yeah, root them out. No. We're getting a lot of event spam right now. Okay. There we go. This war is over, and we'll enforce those demands and disband our troops. We do not want to hold this ourselves, of course, and we could promote a legend. What is this faction? Independence again? Yeah, these guys are a bit of a problem. Indeed. All family members would lose some opinion of him. Okay, that's fine. So this guy loses opinion. But what I want to do is I want to arrange this marriage. I want an alliance with him. We don't necessarily actually want that marriage to go through. But we want an alliance. So something like this. Cool. Okay, so we have this ransom here. That is absolutely fine. We are negative in cash right now. So we need to work our way out of debt. That shouldn't take very long to do, in all honesty. And we should definitely be 12 by now. So we should start swaying our Hogan. Do it. Okay, someone was attempting to murder us. That's very rude. And this guy, he is our regent. He is self-interested despite being at 100 opinion of us. That's not a good sign. Yikes. Okay. Well, we'll see what happens when we come a little closer to coming of age. So these ransoms are completely okay. We do not want to be in debt 
so we're going to accept all of these that are not our direct vassal, which is the majority of them. That seems good. Yep, another 50 gold. I love it. What else do we have going on here? I mean, we could ransom off a few more of these, I'm sure. So it would be like a lot of these. I really don't like it when this goes back up to the top, but <laughs> okay. Okay. That's enough to pull us out of debt. Excellent. So we're out of debt now. And the question is, what is this actual faction? Populists again? Okay, so Zenzir is the main guy here. Fair enough. Hmm. Do we have any brothers or anything? We do. Let's invite this guy to court. Okay. I don't know if we'd actually be able to get this guy to, to agree to this marriage because he's the wrong religion, but let's see what we've got going on here. Yeah, he wouldn't accept this because his faith differs from ours. That's not surprising. How long before we can demand this again? A while. So we're not going to be able to get this guy out of the faction anytime soon. The next guy is only 2.8%. This guy is the whole problem. He's the whole faction. So we may just have to fight him. So 57% chance. This would be a huge faction against us if we attempted to imprison this guy. We could try to boost his opinion of us, but I don't think that's going to be... Outside Leash de Jure. Yeah, I really wish we could fix this if we could build Hispania. The Empire of Hispania cannot be built right now. If we go into the decisions, is there anything about... The Iberian struggle phase is hostility or opportunity, but it is currently in compromise. So we can't do Iberian foothold. Noted. So we would have to wait until that changes. Okay. Okay. What happens if we just conquer all of Iberia? Does the struggle just stop existing? <laughs> Maybe. So this is all part of Hispania here, right? And that is a mild issue for us. Because this guy is a person that exists. So what do we want to do about it? We could demand a hostage. He wouldn't accept this. He has 57 reasons not to. His compassion, his greed, his rationality, her value as a hostage. He has CBs against us. Okay. So he wouldn't accept a hostage. That's noted. What else can we do about him? Not much. I think we want to just get rid of this faction. I think we want to just win the war, ultimately. I really think that's what this comes down to. Sure, we'll take 10 gold here. And to that end, we might want to consider attacking this very large gentleman. And what do we have here? Sheikdom, yeah. De Jure lands up over here. There's a couple of De Jure provinces here. We would not be able to get him entirely under our control, but we would be able to carve him back a fair amount. So there's that. I'm wondering what other titles we can create here. Just a bunch of duchies. We might be able to get some de jure up over here from duchies, but de jure for Asturias sounds good. And then we can do de jure for Navarra. Do we have any de jure for Leon? No, we don't. What about Amaya? That's right in that same area. Sure, that's expensive, but let's do it. So these guys are building up and they might well send their demand eventually. We can try to see if any of these would convert, but I uh, that might actually pull them down below the threshold. Yeah, they almost certainly would. Do it. Okay, so we're going to want to raise up forces here. This uh, Actually, I'll do it here. We'll raise men-at-arms, and they're going to come in here. Okay. We'll 
we'll pay the royal court a visit, I guess. What do we got here? My liege, your liege is paying for my carpet. Definitely. Okay. Are there no sick houses? Indeed. So there's the alms event. That's uh, much less common now and that's very good. We'll gain some dread here and some court grandeur. Okay. So our court physician is no longer a thing. We should appoint someone and we'll appoint our Hogan. That'll be okay for now. He's still at minus 16 opinion of us, which is very rude of him, but whatever. So we're raising up our forces here. They are grouping together out over here. They've actually got a pretty large number of units when they bring in those holy orders. So I'm going to get ourselves up a little bit of numerical assistance here. So we're going to raise up about another 10k here. That'll be fine. And in the meantime, we're just getting the siege done. Uh, no. We're going to veto that. Regent should not be being a jerk. Somebody gained a claim on our empire. They're fighting each other. Hilarious. I love it. Okay, we're going to walk up over here and eliminate this army and get, uh, get done with this war. Sure, we'll accept the challenge. We should win this fairly easily, in theory. Nope, we lost. Okay. <laughs> okay, we yield. That's fine. He became our rival, and our good name was humiliated. That is unfortunate. We had him two to one on the prowess, but I guess it just didn't roll in our favor. That's fine. So we're going to continue to attack out over this way. This war is now done. We'll enforce those demands. And we're just going to siege our way through here. Excellent. So we see them out over here. This is... They're, they're going to attack us? This is a bad idea. They should not do this. They really should not attack us here. This is a very bad idea. So we just stack wiped them, and that's this war over. Fantastic. And let's just move on into Leon over here. Cool. So we see that they are doing some sieging out over here. I don't care. They can do that. We're just going to siege their their war goal over here. Get ticking on our side. Yeah. This is uh, not going to go well for them. We just inherited Menorca, and we definitely don't want to hold Menorca, so we're going to grant that out. Okay. Excellent. We lost the race. Okay, sure. We're not doing well on those rolls, but it doesn't matter. So, we're 20 days left. And this will likely end the war. No, this will definitely end the war. They're heading in to try to fight us. Just them fighting us will end the war. This was a bad idea. So war's over. We're going to enforce those demands and disband our troops. Excellent. We'll grant that out. And that is a little bit more territory under our control. But it is time to put a cut in here. We have this out over here. We want to grant that out for sure. Now we're at 11 of 10. Okay, yeah, that's accurate. That's where we should be. It is time to put a cut in here, so I'm going to go ahead and do that. And next episode, we are going to finish up taking over these areas. We're going to get Maghreb under control. We're still truced there. And Outer Ajuron will be under our control as well. We can do that immediately. So that is looking pretty solid. You can leave your offerings to the engagement gods in the form of likes, comments, subscribes, and bell ringings. And a very special thank you to all of the channel members for making this video possible, including ALS Gamer, Shadow Wolf, Atala, Ali Lee, Dark Horse, Upper Cumberland Gamers, Nick Smarty, Dimitri H, Punching the Microphone, Soccerman 12 UK, Kentogan, and all the rest. And of course, you. Thank you for watching. If you'd like to support the channel, you can click the join button down below the video. And as always, I will see you all next time.